Welcome to Sylvania Center. I'm your host, Phil Filament, with my partner here, Gary Globe. It's been a crazy week here in the world of manufacturing. You're darn right, Phil. Okay, let's pull up our clip of the top manufacturing process of the week here at the Corning Museum of Glass. We'll take a look at the ribboning process of making the globe. Ribboning? I think you mean riveting. All right. Anyway. Wow, look how fast that is, Phil. Yes, this machine makes 1,000 globes per minute. Whoa, that's a lot. Gary, be quiet. <laughs> Just to give you some background, chip soda lime glass is melted in a furnace and fed along a conveyor with blowheads along the top blowing air through the glass into the mold down below the conveyor belt. Water in the mold creates a steam cushion around the molten glass to prevent mold seams and to prevent it from sticking in the mold. I had an uncle that stuck to the mold, Phil. Here we see the ribbon remnants to the right and our fresh globes bouncing to the finish. For all you kids out there, it's not how you start, it's how you finish. Just look at the tortoise and the hare. It's about time you say something worthwhile. Be sure to tune in later for our 3D printing 30 for 30 special brought to you by United Airlines, where you can fly the friendly skies. That's all our time for today. I'm Phil Filament with my co-host Gary Globe from the Badui Broadcasting Center. Stay lit.